Hello and welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be talking about the dreaded Windows automatic repair loop and how to fix it. Before we start, and if you haven't already done so, can you please click like and subscribe to my channel. Many thanks. So without further ado, let's begin. If your Windows 10 or above PC, laptop or tablet keeps displaying this message, automatic repair, your PC did not start correctly. Every time you turn the device on, then you're probably wondering what on earth is going on. But do not panic, there is a solution. The reason you are seeing this screen is due to a number of problems, such as power loss, unexpected shutdown, removal of hardware, software installation, or during the updates. To fix this issue, First you have to click on shutdown and see if the screen was just a one-off incident and see if it will load into Windows. If the screen reappears after pressing shutdown, then click on advanced options. If the automatic repair screen appears, then select advanced options again. You should now see a choose an option screen. Select troubleshoot. Then select advanced options. Select startup repair. Windows will now restart and try and di diagnose and repair files. This can take more than 20 minutes. Hopefully, it will load you into Windows automatically and you have fixed your PC. However, if the startup repair couldn't fix the problem and the window reappears, then we are going to use safe mode. Safe mode is a part of Windows that gives you back files and drivers to allow you to uninstall the lost software that caused the error in the first place or to access the file system so we can fix major issues. Select advanced options. Select startup settings. When the screen appears, select option 4 for safe mode or press F4, whichever your system will allow you to select. Your computer should restart and load into safe mode. Go to the bottom left part of the screen into the start menu and type the command CMD. Do not press enter. CMD is the command for the MS-DOS prompt or the command prompt. A menu on the side will appear. You need to select run as administrator. Hopefully you sh should see the command prompt looking similar to the screen. You need to enter the command SFC slash scan now then hit enter. This will compare the files from a working version of Windows and the ones on your hard disk. If any are seen to be faulty, then the program will replace the faulty files with the healthy working ones. Please note this can take over an hour sometimes, depending on how poor your computer is. When it has finished running, type exit and hit enter to come out of the command prompt and restart the computer. Your PC should be up and running. Thanks for watching the video.